This work has the purpose of exploring the occurrence of the Larsen effect, also known as feedback, through the use of mobile devices in a three-dimensional space. The distinctive screech of the Larsen effect typically occurs when a microphone catches the sound emitted by a speaker. It engages when the microphone is located too close to the speaker and gets in the way of its frequency. The microphone amplifies and reproduces the speaker's frequency with an ever-increasing width, virtually unlimited, in practice stopped by the amplifier's clip. On a ground support, two mechanical arms are located. At the end of one arm, there is a microphone, and on the end of the other, there is a speaker. A software created with this specific purpose manages the position of the arms in a dynamic way and provides that the distance between the microphone and the speaker never causes the amplifier to clip. This way, the system tends to reach an equilibrium that is physically impossible to attain. The struggle to balance creates an acoustic and visual dimension that is never the same. The frequency of feedback and the movements of the mechanical arms are always different and change in real time. In nature, the phenomenon of feedback is the capacity of a system to regulate itself, taking into account the effects of certain modifications to its features. All living beings experience this condition. This project introduces this phenomenon into the world of cybernetics through the use of sound. Sound makes all the movements extremely harmonic and natural, and the mechanical arms show a movement pattern that is similar to the behavior of living beings, such as two animals fighting or courting.
The system changes into a biomechanical organism that has its own life and reacts to external solicitations.